Meanwhile, we do want to get to other news this noon. Neighbors are remembering a man killed in a house fire in Rochester Hills this morning. The fire destroyed a home in the Rochester Estates mobile home community near John R. and Avon Road in Oakland County. Priya Mann has been there since fire crews were battling the fire. And Priya, I know investigators are sharing more with what they're learning and also a connection to possibly a hoarding situation here. Yeah, that's right, Rhonda. That's why firefighters needed specialty equipment to make sure that the fire was fully extinguished. They also had to demolish what was left of the mobile home. Firefighters spent about 60 minutes here just trying to contain this fire. Sadly, a man has died. A lot of people crying. It was it's sad. A tragic mobile home fire just days before Christmas claimed the life of a Rochester Hills man. It's really scary in the trailer park because these trailer parks go up and within five minutes they can be all the way down to the ground. Neighbors woke up early Tuesday morning to thick smoke and flames. And then all of a sudden it just just kept going worse and worse and worse and then went through the living room and we noticed his car was there so we said you know what, he's in there. Emergency responders arrived within minutes. By then, the home was engulfed. Crews did do research, found um, one victim, which unfortunately was a fatality. And at this point, we're just, um, the fire's under investigation by the Oakland County Fire Investigation Unit. The mobile home could not be salvaged and was demolished to prevent hotspots from flaring up. The fire started early Tuesday morning at Rochester Estates near John R. and Avon Road in Rochester Hills. He was a very friendly guy. He helped other people in the neighborhood. He was a very nice man. He knew a lot of these kids for some of their lives, like the kids that lived here. He knew them their whole lives, 11, 12 years. So he's been here for quite some time and he's known a lot of people. Yeah, neighbors were certainly stunned when they woke up this morning. As you can see, what's left of the mobile home, it was completely demolished after firefighters did encounter that hoarding situation. Fire started around 2 this morning. Firefighters were here for uh, quite some time. It took about 60 minutes just to contain the fire. In speaking with the battalion chief, he's urging everyone as a reminder to check your smoke alarms to hopefully prevent another tragedy like this. Again, just days before Christmas, a Rochester Hills man has lost his life. Mm -hmm. Reporting live this morning, I'm Priya Mann, Local 4. So sad, Priya. Thank you.